All right, guys, welcome back to episode two of Titan Souls. <clears throat> Today, we're going to be finishing off the Forest Kingdom and heading over to what somebody recommended was a pretty stressful fight. They recommended the Lava Kingdom, I guess, the mountains. It's really red, they said, so we'll be going there. First, we have to finish off the giant plant thingy that killed us a bunch of times. Um, where we last left off, we just finished killing the mushroom and then got destroyed by the plant. So we're gonna go to yeah, we're gonna go back to him. Now somebody else told me that if you go up this way and then swim in the water and go here, it'll lead, yeah, to another area. And then there's supposed to be something else in here. But I don't know. Let's see if we can find whatever they were saying. They might have just been trolling, but it doesn't hurt to look. Oh, uh, oh well. Well, I guess we'll just go after this guy right now. Um, now, <clears throat> something someone else told me, or actually, I think it was the same person on Snapchat, um, said these arms can actually be cut off if you attack at the same time as, wow, I ran right into that, but if you attack the arms at the same time as they slam on the ground, you can cut them off. Unfortunately, actually, let me check this out again. Unfortunately, when they're cut off and laying on the ground, they can still kill you. Um, let me see. We got it. We got to think of an actual strategy here for this. I'm pretty sure I have an idea of what I want to do. Okay, for some reason I was aiming to the right. That wasn't helpful. Oh, I thought that was perfect. I thought I took off the leg right there. Now. Oh, that was a little bit. Oh, my ah. word. So what I'm looking at, it looks like his mouth is directly open, like right in front of us. Before we start cutting off any legs. That would be perfect, but the gas keeps stopping us, and the legs have, like, their maximum reach. Now, that's another thing I, I found out, like, as you cut off the legs, he does a little spin, and that'll change wherever it is that he breathes in. And you need to hit him in his mouth when he's breathing in to let go of some more gas. See, that should have cut off the legs right away. See right there? That's like the optimal place for him to be at when you want to cut off. Well, not cut off, but when you want to take away that leaf. So right now. And now we got to meet him over here before his leaf pops back up. Ah, oh, missed out. Well, we did take off the leg, so that's helpful, I guess. Oh, he stood in the same spot. Nice. Let's get these other legs cut off now. Oh, no. Oh, now he's shifted positions. Not by much, but for me using a keyboard like direct like directional attacks are better if I'm just doing up down left right I don't have a controller yet so diagonal and like precise aiming isn't really 
in the cards for me. All right, he shifted positions again. All right. All right. Um, so now he's over here, which isn't... Uh, I was going to roll, but I was at the same time scared to roll because I didn't want to roll into the broken body parts. I got to make sure notifications are off so that that doesn't bother me. Is it me or did you release more poison that time? I guess it doesn't really matter, but still, it's kind of weird. Roll, roll, roll. All right. Do a barrel roll! There it is. All right. See, this is the part that gets me. When he does this spin, you can't really tell. Uh, they ask you how you are, poison. you just have All to right. say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never beaten, understand. But I don't want this whole video to be just me dying from this guy. So I'm gonna clip the video as many times as like as much as needed until I actually get the kill. All right. <clears throat> we lost our arrow. But his arms are really short right now, which is perfect. And the area to attack him is pretty clear. So that was a wild miss. All right, now. What? All right. Come over here, let the poison come. Now. Run back. Line it up here. Is this it? Is this the Got end? it. Which right before the poison kills me too. 
What a horrid circumstances led nice. me here. Nice. We got another kill. Is this the cruel, painful plan that was orchestrated by a malevolent deity? Who am I really? Awesome. What purpose did I serve in this life that was granted to me? I suppose I'll never know. If this is what my life has led up to, and if this is truly the end, then I so, accept my fate. I completely lost count on how many deaths and well, I know kills are at six, but deaths I'm guessing were somewhere in like sixteen, seventeen around there. That guy was wrecking me. And there it is. Forest is completed. Now we make our way to what was it? The lava. So let's go. The only thing is, I really wish they would have told me how to get there. So I'm most likely going to cut this until we get to the lava area. Oh, another elevator. Well, going down the elevator. Ah, red. So this is this is the lava area, I presume. And there's three bosses here too. So there was two in the forest, three in the frozen, and three. Well, I'll just call it the tundra, <clears throat> and three in the volcano, maybe. Up, oh, and this is one of them. We got that boss music playing. I, oh, died. I was gonna say I see an I and I. Head first into multi magma. Dental. All right, so let's see. I hope that's the thing. Like he just said, one of them is gonna be really stressful. And let's see if this is it. I've never met a boss that I got killed by touching it before the battle even started. Oh. Yeah, you wouldn't think, well, it is a circle, so it's kind of like the Voltorb Electro thing. They're the fastest Pokemon because they're circle, they roll everywhere. I think their speed got outmatched by another Pokemon, but I'm not sure. I'd have to look into it, but that I know of, they were the fastest. Oh! Oh, I had a clean shot right there. All right, that's the strategy. We're going to go right into that corner. When it lands, just pew, hit him right in the eyeball. If I get rid of it that fast and it turns out this was a stressful monster or boss, whatever, that guy has obviously not fought in the plant guy. That was pretty stressful. Actually, let's do the same strat as... Oh, let's activate it by pulling the arrow back. Oh no, but now my arrow's lost. <gasps> His eye didn't land the same way. Alright. Got popcorn stuck in my teeth. Alright. So the, the strat is going to be activate him, run to the corner, let his eye land the way we need it, and then snipe him. Kobe. Oh no, it didn't work. And I was pulling it back, but it didn't activate on his face. <sighs> All right, this is going to be tougher than I thought.
I got an idea. I'm going to try to just wing it. I'm going to consider this fight the same way as the slime fight. Oh, did not anticipate that. And I'm guessing every way he rolls the fire stuff, I can't run on that either. Alright, this is pretty intense. Alright, so sniping him right when he charges is not an option because his eye rolls in the back of his head first. So, yeah, that, that'd be a no. We are racking up a lot more deaths this round. Um, somebody told me my goal of 50 deaths is unrealistic <laughs> for this game. So, I don't know. Um, very quickly trapping myself. Yeah, I saw that come up. I'm actually going to sacrifice possibly another death right now. I want to see if it's possible to run, like, if the fire is like the poison cloud and see if it's possible to run on it for a little. I doubt it, but that's why it's sacrificing the death. See if I can run on this. Nope. All right. So his fire trail is insta-kill as well. All right, this guy's pretty stressful. I'll put, I'll put a stressometer, maybe, in future episodes. And I'll rate this guy, uh, I'll rate him a five. Just because I found like an easy way. Like, it's pretty easy to kill him. It's just difficult, if that makes sense. The bounce, roll, got him. Um, so yeah, it's pretty easy but difficult at the same time. You need that eye in the perfect spot for that. <clears throat> but who knows? Any boss could be that simple or not so simple. Um, Alright, so that's the first fire boss and the seventh overall boss. Don't know if that was supposed to be the stressful guy. Uh, let's continue looking. There should be two more in here. What is all this? Oh, I think this is another boss right here. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh. Oh. And I don't know his... Oh, I see it. I see his weak spot. I see his weak spot. Shoot. Pull it. Oh, no. Ah, uh, if he would have stayed facing the same way. <clears throat> that, okay. So that's a boss. So I'm guessing all the areas have a boss like that, where it's like, there's no, like, room to itself. It's just there. And when you hit it, it activates. What's this? Oh, another elevator. I'm going to stay here in the fire area. I want to finish off the fire area, then go to the frost, and that's it. It's over here. Oh, there must be another. This is the other boss. <clears throat> it's 
Oh no, there's some stairs. Yeah, this isn't where I want to go. Let's try to find that third boss that's down here. All these gems and stuff. I think the main, like, stressful aspect of the game is the fact that, like, the way your character is from the beginning, that's the way they're going to be until the end. Oh, the third boss was behind the firefall. This is not a waterfall. Oh, the sun. Yeah, why not? Oh! Oh! And I don't even know a weak spot on this thing. I'm guessing it would be the gem? Alright, so we found the other two bosses. I'm going to end this episode here, guys. Um, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, hit that bell icon for notifications on when the next video will drop. Um, I might have to bump up the death... Um, what is it? Like the death counter. I'm going to take a look at what's the least amount of deaths that this game has ever been beaten in. And try to top that. If it's already past what I do have, then I already failed. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for joining me, and it's been awesome. Be sure to comment on what games you want to see me play after this one is done. I know I am pushing towards playing The Long Dark once I get better specs like on the, my current gaming platform. And that's about it. I'll see you guys in the next episode.